I did. I was nervous before, but once that first place sunk in, just felt comfortable out there. But I didn't I didn't expect to be the player of the game, though. No. All the blitzes that they threw at you and stuff like that, is that pretty good preparation for first? Oh, yeah, we had tons of time to get ready for that. Coaches put us in a great position. We hammered all their blitzes. We knew what they were going to do, so it just worked out. When did you find out that John was out and that you'd be getting the start? Well, the whole, I was been ready to play. We didn't really know, so we didn't know what John was going to do. So I, in the back of my mind, I was ready to play the whole time. So did you not find out until you got on the field for warm-ups or before? That? No, I knew before. It was it was a good chance I was playing, but so I, I was preparing. I was going to play for the last couple of weeks. Our boss says you might be in the mix now with the right side. Are you still taking reps on both sides? Or? I'm mostly left right now because, but so I'll figure it out once John's fully back. And what's the big difference? Left and between right. Right. Yeah. I mean, it's because I played right last year, mm -hmm. so it's it's not a huge difference. You just got to get about a couple days of reps up either side, and you feel comfortable again. Do you have a preference between the two? Not really. Just wherever they put me, I'm fine with. Ed said last night that there was a play where you flipped the protection and then Shay threw a touchdown to Sean. Can you take us through that play? Do you remember what you said? I mean, we practiced that all week. There, the Sam came up and just pointed out to it, let Caesar know, and it worked out. Mm -hmm. so, but we've been practicing that all week. So, Was there a point where you realized that you felt really comfortable making those type of calls at the line? I mean, I was comfortable with that. Like, I knew what I was going to do going into the game. It was just about getting in there, getting ready. But I felt confident before. But just doing everything right, just putting in a good position. What's the key to learning those things? Um, just being in meetings every day, being attentive, just watching film, really knowing what they're going to do, getting their tells. So. What's your weight now, and what were you when you came in? When I came in, I was about, what was that, like 245, 250. Getting, I'm pretty close to 300 now, I'm about 295. What's your ultimate goal? Have they told you what they want you to be? I mean, they haven't really told me anything specific, but I'd like to play around 310, 315. What's that process like, adding that much weight that quickly? I thought it was going to be tough, but with Herb and Abigail, it's been a lot better than I thought it was going to be. You know, they put me in a great position with what to eat, what to do, what to work on. It's been good. How many calories gifted? You did there? We don't do anything no. like that, no. So, yeah. On one who called you the skinniest lineman, um, which is true. <laughs> <laughs> how do you how do you feel like you did just physically the strength of the game going against a you know an actual opponent? Yeah, I was I was pretty nervous before because I didn't know what it was gonna be like. But once I get in there, I felt fine. I didn't feel weak. Just felt good.